Hey guys, it's Rob here with a quick video before I go off to work. Um, in the last video, I showed you this uh, Southwest Indian Ridge here. And um, I told you that uh, maybe in the last video or the one before that, that this is probably one of the most important surface features on our planet because it is responsible for most of the re uh, features on our planet. And uh, remember in the last video I showed you line up with uh, the northern part of Africa and that gouge at the top and stuff? Well, that's not the only thing that it lines up with. Um, I wanted to show you that here we have North America. And I'm going to bring this in uh, through the bottom here and show you that here's Florida right here. I'm going to bring this in like here and I'm gonna line this up with that right there and just like that you can see that this is one of the underlying processes that created well Florida and you could tell because look as I line it up here it's a little blurry because it's not the greatest resolution I have to get close-up shots for that when I will but you can see that that there's a line that runs down Florida right here you can see that as I line that up here you can see that there's lines here that, that match it like that and then it looks like it matches the other other features too but it also looks like a reversal a mirror image of Florida this next one right here next to it see actually kind of looks more like it's right on it just needs to rotate a hair but you can see how it it matches the some of the lakes right there the big lake maybe that line again and hopefully you can see this now what's cool about that is that let me pull it back in where it was you can see that as I line it up there you can see this runs across and it starts to to hit the features up here you can see that here's uh, the Hudson Bay when I bring this over you can kinda see that already it's 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 uh, playing with the Hudson Bay a lot the features are, are are kind of lining up. You see how this looks like that island right there with the, the way that its marks are? You can see that there's these lakes right here and when I line that up you can see that this line goes through those lakes. And what else does it do? Let's see here. Hate this thing. Let's see what else it points. See how it hits the, the lakes right here? But you can see it also plays into the other features too. Okay, so then I move it up more and you can see that now it's really playing into the features here um, with the Hudson Bay. see how these narrow they, they kind of come together at this island and stuff like that and then I keep moving it and it keeps lining back up with this bill it looks, this thing looks like a bird or a duck or something that's the way I always remember it and you can see that lining up with the island again as I'm moving this through and then Let's see what else. Then I just simply how'd that happen? Hold on. Then I simply just move it over. And you can see right here how it lines up with the um, the Gulf of Mexico. 
it's those things right there that they line up with the Gulf of Mexico too but look at the west coast here you know how you got this point right here you can see it right here look that's a discharge pattern I believe off of Africa and then as that lines up there you can see that this lines up here totally and then as I bring this over more you can see that this lines up the the ridge lines up with the west coast perfect you can even see that what was responsible for making Florida is responsible for uh, the um, what you might call it the California Basin area which they in geology they believe that the California Basin area is made by stretching they think the plates are pulling this area apart and thinning it out stretching it out but that can't be the case because what what, what stretched this out to match it because these are two separate areas far away from each other and what business do they have matching when plate tectonics is spreading these areas east and west this area is actually down south on all the other side of uh, Antarctica why is it matching up with the crazy surface features here on the west coast and well look what we got here we got uh, Yellowstone Park see this is Yellowstone Park it looks like a flower I think I have to rotate it like that oops oh, what the fuck okay hold on sorry about that I'm in a hurry I gotta go to work as usual see how it matches now might even have some of these little uh, things hanging off right here there it goes and it matches even better now on the, on the west coast but you could see that now this is I'm making a video using this um, southwest Indian Ridge right at the moment where I show it line up with a lot of different features around the world so this isn't the only one and you've seen how this lines up with Africa and if you have any knowledge of plate tectonics you should know that this means that plate tectonics is done look look how Africa now matches here the the discharge pattern this is this is an electrical discharge pattern and it has reoccurring patterns all over the planet including here like that see look how perfect that is look how it fits the features exactly if this wasn't so blurry, <laughs> you could see that, that, that it matches perfect. I'm going to have to do close-up shots of this area because... Look at that. Give me a break. And then here's the Grand Canyon. And this looks a lot like it. The canyons right here. The canyons, they swoop out and then they go back in. And you can see this just needs to rotate a little bit more apparently but you can see look at that match here like that look at that I got a guy that he, he comments on my old videos that they don't match so I sent him to these new ones I said well let's see you say that here and he doesn't but in the old videos he, he brings it up He'll say, yeah, those, those things don't match. I go, well, why won't you put that in the video that you're talking about? <laughs> and he, and he, he won't. He says he's doing me a favor. I'm like, okay, motherfucker. I bet you <laughs> I bet you, you see these alignments, and now you don't want to admit it. Because that, I mean, look at that alignment right there. Look, right here, even. See how it keeps matching over and over again? it's because our planet is covered with reoccurring patterns and the reoccurring patterns are the core of this planet because it's the only thing it can be the plant our planet is created by its core and that in science 
they're unaware of that. They think that our planet's created by an accretion disk, which means particles like dust in outer space have clung together to build up this enormous planet and then separated the metals and you know by weight and all this stuff that, you know and then they got plates well, where the plates come from and where the continents come from then what makes the continents and the plates they can't tell you really but I've shown you what lines up with the the, the continents and what they call plates and they're all related to one small area about this big and it's the core of this planet um, thanks for watching guys